Welcome back to another day in the life of me, just Steve. The sun is shining this morning. I think it might rain. I really want to get the jungle cut, but yeah, I've got no petrol for the lawnmower and need some oil. Good morning, Lee. Well then. How are you, Flea? Okay. Lee the flea. Anyway, you join us on big clean day. So I'm just about to clean the downstairs bathroom. Uh, get on with the day. I think Chloe's going out. Our friends are outside there. That's how, yeah. She's off out. Oh, Aaron and Lacey were a nightmare last night. I'm pretty good. My wallpaper hasn't come yet for the kit. Well, it has, but we missed it the other day. I want to get this kitchen papered today. But uh, that's not happening. I'm just going to go and check screw fix before I get on with this bathroom. See if they've got any um, lawnmower oil or if not screw fix, what's the other one? Tool station, is it? Yeah. Right, guys. Liam and I are off out. I've got, I've got my engine oil out to get it from screw fix. The other one didn't have any in. I mean, Milo's a big boy and he's even getting lost in there. And just like that, it's done. Got three bags of grass, mind. Yes, looks better though. And I got to use a new trimmer that I got for Christmas. Time for a coffee, isn't it, my? It's had a bit of a tidy up out here. Loads of rubbish. Loads. I need a skip. Literally need a skip delivering. Oh, look, sand. You haven't been on the telly today. Looking lovely today. Yeah, it's nice outside today in the sun. Bit in the breeze, you know, but... Are you laughing at? No. Okay. Right, guys, you've probably seen a lot of these all over the internet at the minute. They are just flying off the shelf from different companies. You've probably seen them on TikTok mainly, but whew, these things. Portable label maker. So there's some others that I've seen online where people are actually using them to print off um, shipping labels and things like that. This is made by Queety, I think. I'm just pronouncing that right. I'm sorry if I'm wrong, but everything will be in the description below if you're interested. Anyway, let's take a look. Packaging's really nice on it, I have to say. Excuse my coffee table. There's some information for you guys. Pause if you need to read. Let's slide it out then. See what we've got. Obviously, information booklet if you need it. And then here we have the printer itself. So there's the inside of it. There's your sticker paper. And inside here is where, obviously, we would uh, replace that, change it when it's run out. As you can see, it's tiny. So you're not going to be printing um, shipping labels off with it. But also there's the QR code there. And that is, I believe, well, it says to get a template. I was just thinking, I'm hoping it's got some juice in it. I was thinking there's no cable, but there is. Don't worry, the other end of the box, there is a cable to charge it. Once you've got the paper in and you've put your side back on, this just slides on and off, guys, um, to access it so it's not hard. Uh, and you've got your app downloaded. Next thing is to power it on. Obviously, there's all sorts of little de uh, designs that you can make, little sticker designs and things, which will be good. Kids probably love it as a present, but yeah, we're going to print one out. Once you've got your app downloaded, open it up and uh, just allow it to connect to your Bluetooth and click on your model. You should find it, and there you go, we are connected, as you can see. It tells you some information up the top here about being connected, battery percent, and then you've got some settings. That's all about the device. And then you've got paper type. You can have gap paper, continuous paper. And it also shows you how to load it. So right now, I'm trying to uh, make my own little label, uh, logo label here. I'm making a right mess of it. Because, you know, first time use it and all that. But we'll just print out something simple. Yeah, so as you can see, I'm putting something really simple. Why did I put something to do with Christmas? I have uh, no idea whatsoever. Like I said, didn't know what I was doing. Santa logo there. How nice. There's just some more tips for you. And now we're going to print it out. 
So there you have it. There's my silly little design with Santa on that says, Hi, this is Steve. Please subscribe. But then you have this button here, which you just slide and it'll cut it for you. So if we do that, there you go. Peeled the back off. And there you go. You got a sticker. And then you can go and wind your parents up or whoever and stick them everywhere. But actually... These would actually come in like really handy if you wanted to organise something like folders or whatever, or on food jars, cereal, you know. If you've got them in containers, you could put the names and stick them on. So there you go, guys. So if it's something that you're interested in, go check out the link in the description. I think there's different colours as well. I've got the white one, but I think there's green. Uh, there's probably others. Um, but yeah, go check it out. Link is in the description below there we have it guys that was a just a quick little review of that um but thanks for sending that out to me it's it's kind of cool kids will like it printing things off but like i said if you're uh, wanting to organize stuff and things have labels on you, you know like i said there's many different things on the app that you can do to print out different things design your own so you have good fun with it do you ever find sometimes you go through stuff at home like nobody's business and then other times it goes to waste well at the minute bread and milk we're going through just like that and then there's other times we're throwing no end away so i'm currently out i've just popped into co-op and bought some more bread i bought a loaf earlier um and while we're here liam's nicked over the road he's gone to the chip shop to get some chips we're having uh fish chips and mushy peas tonight but we're cheating with the chips yes indeed so Rachel's got the fish on at home and the mushy peas because I got them from Aldi the other day. And he's gone to get the, the chips. So I've asked him to get scraps or scrumps, whatever you call them. What do you call them, guys? You know, little bits of batter off the sausage and the fish and all that good stuff. Because I know in different places around the, around the country, people say different things. Ah, right. I'm gonna go pick him up. Ice cream man's around. Anyway, I should be looking here, not there. But it's tea time at the bad house. Fish, chips, and mushy peas. They're on the telly now, so. Oh, look at Amy. Bless her. Oh, tell everyone the good news. She's got some results through today from college. Good eye. Well done. Well, yeah. Yeah, well, we know about the mass. You, you haven't really been to it yet, have you? No, because my teeth are a bit of a... I don't know how to explain. She's not very nice to me. Let's try it. Because I'm fit. That's nice. She's not very nice. Right, we're going to go and enjoy so, tea. Why is this like escaping out of hand? Mum might have a bath for a day or two. Haha, <laughs> you sick hard. I know I've not done a lot to the garden. I keep looking outside and thinking, oh, is it the same place? It was long, wasn't it? Just chopping it has tidied it right up, which has done it good because it's dried it out a little bit. Although, according to Rach, it's going to rain for two weeks. Yeah, that's good, isn't it? Anyhow, tea was good. That's it. Got washed up, getting cleaned up, and just going to chill. Um, might watch a bit of telly with Rachel tonight. No boxing on, I don't think. But there is tomorrow night, so I'm looking forward to that on a Sunday. That's because it's Easter. Four to ten, guys, in the evening, Saturday evening. And Rachel and I are just about to watch a film. Beekeeper, Jason Statham. Is that right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'll let you know my thoughts after. That film, I enjoyed. I'd give it a good eight out of ten, I reckon. Yeah. Well... Well worth the watch. Anyway, it's time to go to bed. Chloe's still awake for some reason. She thinks there's an Easter bunny coming tonight. And perhaps there is. We'll see tomorrow, won't we? You laughing at Lacey. <laughs> you really think he's going to come dressed up? Well, I don't know. Or is it maybe you? I'm going to be asleep, so I'm not going to see the Easter bunny coming. But uh, I hope okay. if anyone, any of you guys celebrate Easter, I hope you have a good and don't eat too many chocolate eggs and spoil your dinners. You know, be good, stay safe, and uh, yeah.
She's laughing at me. She's always <laughs> laughing at me. Did you really think that Saul coming to dry store? You really Question. Think, you really think Saul's going to come in your house and go, oh, I've got some Easter. Yeah, with a little basket. Uh, no, don't think so. Is there is. No. And also, what we want to know is, why is there an Easter bunny and not a chicken? Because chickens lay eggs and things and bunnies don't lay eggs. But maybe they do chocolate ones. You really think that it's going to yes. be someone in the house? Of course they will. Uh, no, no, right. That's you. No, well, I'm off to bed. Yeah, and you come She's back. She's like, excited, no. really. No, I'm not. Yeah. And you come <laughs> back down and put them no. down when Chloe's Mommy, asleep. Mummy's had to lick that pill and she'll be gone. And I won't be long after. Yeah, and then you wake her up and then you go, oh, she's asleep now. And then you quickly no, go down no, and do no, it. No, no, no. Yes, you do. I'm not kidding. <laughs> yes, you do. She's just excited. Anyway, uh, we'll see you guys so. tomorrow for Easter Sunday. Thanks for watching. Take care. I don't think so. Excited.